Hi, it's Greg from Get Out There Magazine, and this is the start of the 100 mile, 50 mile, and 100 mile relay at the Sulphur Springs Trail Race in Ancaster. All of the race distances today are running on a 20 kilometer loop in the Dundas Valley Trail System. I'm running the 25 kilometer race, and these are my home trails, so I'm going to take you on a tour. Let's go. This is the 20th anniversary of the Sulphur Springs Trail Run, and a record 1,000 spots were available across the various distances, which is up a couple hundred from last year, and it's still sold out early. It's part of the Ontario Ultra Series and is included in the brand new OUS Slam. Check out their website for more details. On each 20k loop, runners passed an aid station four times, plus had a stop at the start-finish area. Race director Joe Hewitt and the Burlington Runners did a great job marking the trail and a course map and detailed directions were available ahead of time on the race website. Hey, sir. All right, big hill up the Headwaters Trail. It's most definitely a grueling hilly course, but the scenery is just magnificent and everyone I encountered had an upbeat attitude and offered lots of encouragement to other runners. And we're out on the road for a little jaunt before we're back into the trails. An exciting news from this year's race, a new course record in the 100 mile was set by Glen Redpath in 15 hours and 40 minutes. 10k in and down some steep hills. This is the Sulphur Creek Bridge that the Burlington Runners installed a few years ago to improve the course and enable this race route. At about 12 and a half kilometers, here's a tough little switchback. Good news for runners this year. The mud that you've seen in previous years, not here. The course has been prepared with gravel and it's dry. Beautiful. Here's some quick single track off the G. Donald Trail prior to an ascent up Martin Road. About 19k into the race, climbing up a set of hills called the Three Sisters. We're at the westernmost point of the course up top of the Three Sisters and it opens up onto Farmer's Field. Back on Martin Road, just one kilometer to go, mostly climbing. And I did mean climbing. Here we are in the home stretch going up Martin Road again. And into the finish. I'm Craig from Get Out There Magazine, and I hope you enjoyed this race report on the Sulphur Springs Trail Run, and I definitely encourage you to check out this great event next year.